everybody, this is Alchemist 2 and I'm back again with another series review. I just recently watched MLP FIM. The episode was called Parental Guidance. And in this one, Scootaloo is going to Cloudsdale so she can do a report on um, a pony that inspires her. And of course, we all know that Scootaloo is a raging Rainbow Dash fangirl. And when she's there, she gets to meet um, Rainbow Dash's parents. And she's just throwing a fit. She's just having a blast and she's having the best day ever <laughs> and it's just so cute to, to just see her um squee like that <clears throat> but what happens is her parents are a little bit overzealous in how they're cheering for her and rainbow gets really embarrassed by it and she says some rather hurtful things back to her parents and then Scootaloo becomes very, very upset with her and, and how um, angry that she became. And she tells her that she wasn't always the best at everything and she had a tendency to mess up. And of course we have seen in prior episodes that Rainbow was rather clumsy and... <laughs> sometimes she would crash into stuff and she always well when she became a wonderbolt she earned the name rainbow crash of course we remember that but it was nice to see her um come to the realization of the fact that she's not a goddess of some sort that yeah she's gonna make mistakes she's going to make gaffes every so often and what she said to her parents was very blunt and extremely hurtful and she almost felt like she couldn't unring a bell but with the help of Scootaloo she was able to apologize and she realized what she did was wrong and it was very very touching I felt to, to see that good nuclear family coming back together and <clears throat> even <laughs> Scootaloo getting her report and doing so well on it and Charlie gave her a B <laughs> and I thought ah that's so cool that's so neat and there was uh, that sandwich in the report, too, and I thought that was hysterical. I thought, well, that was just for added effect, and maybe it took up three-fourths of the report because it was so large, but she needed her carbs. And it, it was just really quite a outstanding episode, and it got to develop Scootaloo more, and the other Cutie Mark Crusaders were there. They were more of um, side characters. Scootaloo took center stage. And I like that. I like the fact that the <clears throat> CMC were getting more screen time with them, which I think is terrific. And uh, I hope to see more of Starlight Glimmer, too, because I, I really like Starlight. And I know a lot of people are probably going to give me flack for that. But I like Starlight because... She is a character that started out with very sinister intentions and really didn't know how to go about making friends. And she's basically the new Twilight. <laughs> and of course, I've been seeing a lot of Pegasisters and um, Bronies up in hooves saying, Oh, please don't make her an alicorn. <clears throat> Because, of course, there's only two alicorns, one being Flurry Heart and the other one being um, Twilight. So it, it stands to reason that uh, at some point in time, I guess, um, Twilight would become Princess Twilight at some point in time, I do believe, if unless Cadence uh, would have Flurry as the next that's very possible. I don't know. It's There's a lot of theorizing that would go on in that case, but perhaps that's left well enough alone, and I think only Lauren Faust would be able to answer that question, but yeah, until now, I'm just left with speculation, but it was a really sensational episode. I absolutely loved it. I'm a, I'm a big Rainbow fan, and even though Pinky's my favorite, but I, I love Rainbow. Rainbow's just a really awesome pony, and 
the fact that she's very uh, headstrong. <laughs> yeah, she can be a little bit impulsive, and I love the fact that she can sleep wherever. I thought, that's kind of neat. That's, that's an interesting little trick that she has, and just zonk out <laughs> right in place. I thought, hmm, I know there are people that can fall asleep standing up. I am not one of them, but I don't really... Um, I, I don't really, uh, I'm not jealous of them, but that's pretty much all I got to say about, uh, MLP this time, and I'm looking forward to more episodes to come, so until next time, live long, prosper, ciao, tootsie.